fuck is wrong with you, Tanya? Ain't nothing wrong with me, nigga. Shit. Well, your ass don't look too good. Where the fuck is JB? Smoking. And what about you? I mean, you know, I quit. You know what I'm saying? Almost. Yeah, whatever. JB, look, JB gonna lose everything. He gonna lose the house. You know what I'm saying? The business, everything, and you his cousin, nigga. You said you was gonna he help. He ain't my cousin. Whatever, if that's how you feel. What the fuck do I know about touring cars? Look, it's easy. If JB can do it, you can do it for fuck's sake. Come on, I'm gonna show you. Come on, shit. All right, then. Shit. everything. Hey, look, let's make this quick. I got shit to do. Nigga, you need to slow it down. Uh, Tanisha was right. Oh. That's what I'm talking about. You doing it old school. All right, shit, where we going? Trucks at the Davis Sheriff Impound. Oh, man, how did I get dragged into this? We both know you always been sweet on me. <laughs> shit, Franklin Clinton. Shit, your ass must be high or something. I told you, I don't do that shit no more. I mean, I baby doze now and again just for the taste. But I'm doing good, boo. Your eyes don't lie. Whatever you say, girl. Come on. There's JB's truck. Let's go bring the cha-ching, homie. Not easy enough for JB to drag his ass out of whatever crack house he laying in. His loss, yo gain, sugar. Except I ain't gaining shit, sugar. Move that seat back, and you know I'll make it right for you. That ain't what I'm saying. Damn, Tanya, what the fuck happened to you? Okay, I've seen JB do this a hundred times. Back up close, make sure the hook is down, and it should slide right in. Hey, boo! Okay, we are in, baby. Let's get this back to the lot. Hey, this was not how I saw my day going. So I ain't seen you around the hood much? I've been trying to branch out. Can't stay in Chamberlain Hills forever. Oh, nigga got airs now. I remember you before you was a wannabe when you just was. And I remember you and JB before y'all was dope in. Shit changes. You the one all turfed up. JB smoking, but he ain't smoking homies. He out here grinding, towing cars, paying bills. For real? Cause I could have sworn it was me out here touring cars for him. And looking damn fine doing it too, baby. Okay, we make the drop where they got the area's marks. They get real finicky when we don't leave it in the right place. I'll see you on the block. Anything you need, you holler at me. But you know what? It's getting to be a bit much. I have no idea how you cope. Of course I cope. I'm a woman. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? <laughs> <laughs> but girl, I done done all that I can do. But you know how boys are. Wait a minute. Oh, girl. Whew. Hey, how much further? We ain't even gone five yards yet. Okay. I know, I'm just asking. This is spirit walking. Exercises body and soul. It's all the rage. We are women and we are free. Free in the We are women. We are free. We are women. We are free. We are women. We are free. We are women. Damn. F, is that your auntie? Yeah, thank God I missed her crazy ass. She's spirit walking this shit now, man. That's just her attempts to... Hey, hey, don't be talking shit about your auntie, man. She got... 
I mean, she cool as a motherfucker, man. Come on. Come with. We gotta go pick up some shit from around the corner, man. We can walk and talk at the same time, my nigga. Why the fuck we can't drive? Around the block with Chop? You need to walk with your fat ass. <sighs> yeah, okay, you tall, linky son of a bitch. Homie, we ain't got all day. Let's go. For sure, but what you got up? Kidnapping fool, that clown D, that OG fool from Baller. Dog, I told you, no more game banging retro vengeance bullshit. I'm trying to make some fucking paper. You gonna make some paper, low? And ain't nobody out here gang banging. It just look like that. You gotta know the difference, man. Fuck, man, great. My aunt would be very happy, homie. She wants me dead anyway, so she can get the fucking house. <sighs> you got the wheel, homie. Your dog, homie. Me and Chop got a lot in common. You're annoying. It. Man, I'm carrying both of y'all asses, homie. Look what I set up. Man, fuck this, man. Think Tanisha? She's straight. It's me and you that ain't straight, though, homie. Dog, I know, homie. Look, I met this contact, this white dude. Real serious dude, man. This motherfucker know the streets, homie. I know he'll be a good hookup for us. We don't. Need no hookup, fool. I know these streets. You know the these streets. Man, are you? You know it's dime bag hustling, credit card stealing, boosting gas tankers, homie. Come on, man. You trying to be some fucking commodity trader or something? Fool, that shit went up, man. Look, homie, I don't mind dying, you feel me? But I just want to die with something that matters, homie. That's what foreign gangsters should really be about. And I know this much, the motherfucking OGs ain't even giving a fuck about us, though. Man, fuck. It's the OGs, then. You know what I'm saying? This ain't no motherfucking pyramid scheme. He down this alley up here. Hey, what's up, boo? Ain't you little Laida's cousin? Yeah. Damn, you short with it? I was just saying, I was trying to and holler at you. you ain't hollering at nothing over here. Why has it gotta be like that? I'm an OG. An OG, so what? So the fuck what, nigga? It's a million OGs Well, shit, here. how about I put one of these little X pills up your ass crack? Next thing you know, you're gonna be begging for it, boo-boo. That's boo -boo. disgusting. What's happening now, D-man? Ain't no fun if the gangsters can't have none. Man, fuck you, Mark. I ain't sharing no ass to CGS. Ain't nobody sharing nothing. Man, shut the hell up, fuck bitch. Fuck you, nigga. Man, fuck y'all. Hey, ain't there a law against you, Mark ass, gangsters, insignia, mask wearing motherfuckers? Oh, so what's up now, nigga? You snitching or something, oh, nigga? Oh, shit! Bitch ass nigga! Fuck you, nigga! I'm out of here! Fuck y'all, hey, bitch! That, nigga. Come on, let's go! In the van, we gotta go! <laughs> What he driving? Man, we in a van, motherfucker. We fucked. Oh, gangster, we got this. It's gonna get bumpy, Chop. We losing it. Damn, you okay, Chop? <laughs> oh, geez, getting away. You seen that bitch back there? She a dog. I'm all over that. And she probably the same. Like I said, they blocked. Block your mind on this shit right here for a minute. You worse than Chop. He going left. Pull left. I don't know what you can Distributing right now, fool. We might have to rethink this 60-40 split. Me? You ain't doing shit. Chop is doing more to get this nigga than you. And he just drooling. Next time we going at the motherfucking. All right, all these punk ass bites. Oh shit! Damn! He got fucked up. Man, take time. Go get that fool. Nigga, you just sitting your ass there with your feet kicked up. 
Come on, chop. Come on. Go bite his ass. Get that motherfucker, chop. Get him. Hey, Chop, what you smell? Oh, man. That ain't what we after. Chop, no! Get out that thing, Chop, you filthy motherfucker. Come on, Chop. Get off there, man. We got shit to do. This ain't time for humping, Chop. Come on, man. Lamar show ain't been training your ass, has he, boy? Get back on that fat motherfucker, Chop. We in this together, Chop. Let's go. Lay down, bitch. Shit. This motherfucker empty. This one. Hey, Chop, that smell like a baller. Give it up. You scared of dogs, nigga? Oh, shit! Fuck you and your stupid dog. Don't hump him. Bite his ass, Chop. Get his ass. Fuck you, you son of a bitch! That bitch just fucking bit me, man! Shut the fuck up. Hey, man, get over here! Oh, shit! What the fuck, man? I ain't got no beef with the CTF! Because maybe we doing our own thing. What the fuck, what the man? Fuck the fan, punk? Shit! Hey, Lamar Davis, is that you, nigga? Nigga, shut the fuck up. Just get in. Yeah, that's you, nigga. Fucking oh, idiot. Shit. I said I had no beef, man. Shut the hey, fuck up. Hey, man, what the Watch fuck? You, boy. Get this fucking dog away from me. Come on. Fuck! Hey, if you don't train Chop, he gonna be a lost cause like you, dawg. We gonna stash this dude in my spot. We going back to your crib? I've been there when you was in diapers. Shut up, man. You ain't recognize me. I knew it was you before you took that flag off. You always been dumb, Lamar. Really? Well, I guess that means we gonna have to shoot your ass. <laughs> Pick up our 40 stacks. You ain't gonna pick up shit. Fans gonna be on you before you can even move, nigga. Be quiet. I gotta make a call. We 
got your boy. You calling him on the cell phone, you dumb motherfucker? They gonna trace this shit in a second. We want 40,000. Just pay me or pay the funeral director, motherfucker. What the fuck you done done? You just gave them our location. Now we gotta let this motherfucker out of here. Get the fuck out of here. And nigga, give me that damn phone. What the fuck? Fuck y'all. I'll be seeing y'all soon. The only reason you've been seeing shit cause we went easy on your ass. Remember that, dawg? Oh, you owe me a bike too, you motherfucker. This some bullshit. Take me down the cut. Man, what the fuck is wrong with you, nigga? All right, motherfucker. You the motherfucker. You better watch out for them ballers. They gonna be on you now. The cops gonna be on your ass, too. Yeah, I ain't worried about it. I'm a motherfucking gangster. You know how I do. I can take care of my sizzle. No, the fuck you kids ain't. She fucked up brick in my bed. <laughs> Bullshitting me. It wasn't like that. You in? Fuck it, I'm in. Let's roll. Let's get this motherfucker. Just don't kill him! <laughs> you okay, homie? What happened? The guy bounced my wife is what happened. Which guy? The guy I'm paying to teach her tennis. Tennis coach? Oh, that's fucked up, man. You risk me, homie. You know, back in the hood, ain't you looking? You know, back in the hood, man, we gotta watch out for the mailman, dog. Yeah, I'm a cuckold, a snob, and a fucking cliche. Man, look the fuck out. Dude almost got away, man. back of the truck. Tied a cable to one of those supports up there. You finna pull his deck down? Hey, that prick pulled my marriage down. Man, you really gonna be this fucking dramatic? Yeah, whatever. I told you I comp the session, bud! Well, there were a lot of freaking sessions, bud! I'm thinking you were working on more than just her backhand! Mandy's backhand has come a long way, bro. But sometimes it's gotta get worse to get better. Yeah, well, maybe I should come up there and practice my backhand! On your face! Oh, bud, your negative energy is seriously bringing me down. Oh, I hope it is, bud. We hooked up, man. You come into my house, take my money, and nail my wife? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm gonna stick up my hand and say that was uncool, bud. My bad. Seriously. Oh, how fucking magnanimous. May I please offer you my applause? You fucking motherfucker! Dude! And we'll see how you like it when someone fucks with your shit! Well, hey! Wait! You got the wrong idea, pal! Whoa! Fuck! Here we go! Ha-ha! <laughs> Let's see what happens! Dude, you are probably crazy! <laughs> oh, shit! Sorry, damn, but already! Man, fucking drop it! Man, I think that shit's 
coming down, man. Do it, man. Fucking do it. Trying to pull that dude house off the fucking hill? Hey, we were trying to teach him a fucking lesson. Now that's an expensive bitch ass lesson, man. Maybe he'll keep it on the court and out of my wife. Yeah, he not taking no housewives back to that motherfucker. Hey, it's a service to the fucking community. Oh shit! Oh shit! Mr. DeSanta, what the hell? That's not my house! Bullshit. Oh, bro, I couldn't afford a place like that. I'm a tennis coach. I hit balls for a living. I was just hiding there. Give me a pawn. You! You're a dead one! Green light! Green light! Martin Madrazo, give you green light! Oh, I'm scared, lady. Just fucking terrified. Yeah. Hey, man, it's a mean looking motherfucking essay right behind me. Oh, that was quick. All right, help me deal with this. I get the phone, man. Keep trying. We can handle this, right? Screw it. If these are... Mark Madrasso's boys, man, it's a lot more where they came from. How much distance we got between us? Hey, let's go. Let's leave them behind. Fucking idiot. Get rid of them! Push the pedal, man. We gotta move. Hey, hey! All right, all right. We got a book, man. Go! Chill hey, let's go. Let's leave him behind. I said, motherfucker. Yeah, my nigga, that's it. Okay, and go. Go back to my house and think about this. Wow. Shit. You did good. I mean, your aim's all over the place, but you were a help. Ah, uh, thanks. I guess. Hey, don't get the fence. Go to a shooting range. Work on your aim. You'll do fine. Oh, fuck, man. Shit, you good? Fine as wine. Got a few knots. You okay? I mean, you did good, kid. Man, I'm cool, man. I mean... I mean, you. Mentally. Mentally? Oh, man. I'm fucking excellent. My heart ain't pumped like that in years. Oh, yes, fucking A, Bubba. Man, you sound kind of mad. You just been greenlit by the Mexican underworld ambassador to Los Santos. Whew. Hey, thanks for the help out there today, kid. I had no idea it was gonna get that hot. Shit, pulling houses off the hillside sure has a weird way of fucking with people. Yeah, well, I thought I was through with all that shit. I don't know what the hell's going on. Oh, shit, I think we're about to find out. Do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? Do you? No. Who are you? You? I think so. Good. I know who you are. I know where you live. Who are you? I'm Franklin. License. Now, Franklin. Maybe help Mr. DeSanta here. Who am I? I think Martin Madrazo. Good boy. Now, maybe give him a little of the background. Man, Mr. Madrazo... It, Mr. Madrazo is a legitimate businessman who was wrongfully accused of running a Mexican-American gang and a narcotic ring, but the charges were dropped because of the witnesses came up missing. Smart kid. Now, Michael, I've got a question for you. Did you pull an architectural, significant, modernist, wonder home down the hillside in Vinewood Hills? I thought the owner was banging my wife. Well, that was a strange house for a tennis coach. <sighs> I was thinking straight. Mm, clearly. Yeah. <sighs> well, Natalia will <sighs> need a hotel while you finance the rebuilds, won't she? Sure. Good. 
And I'm guessing here that the rebuild uh, will be somewhere in the 2.5 million range? <laughs> of course. Great. That's nice. Come on, man. Damn, you all right? Never better. So what now? Looks like I'm gonna have to postpone my retirement. Fuck. Ah, oh, man, I'm mortgaged up to my eyeballs. Look, I only know one way to make money. I'm gonna have to give an old friend a call. Lester. I think he's in town somewhere. I'm gonna have to track him down. Just give me a little alone time, all right? All right, though. Hello. Is this still the number for Lester Crest? Who's asking? Who's asking? Who's asking? You're awful cagey. <laughs> <clears throat> Even for a dead man, Michael. Ooh. You don't sound good, buddy. <laughs> Tactful and charming, even in death. Hey, come see me, old friend. I'm living in Los Santos, just like you. Marietta Heights. Whoa, whoa, wait. Hey, how do you... Hello? You fucker. Fuck you, Lester. You gonna let me in or what? Give me a minute. I was wondering when you'd show up. I was dead. Praise be. Guess you weren't very dead. You need my help. How do you know? Because you came here. Why else would you? <clears throat> I haven't been a good friend for you, Lester. I know that. And you're gonna make it up to me by doing whatever I ask. Or rather, I, I mean, I need something done, you need to know something, so why not help each other? I gotta make some dough. So you're back in the game? I guess. Look, Lester, about what happened before. Oh, I know you never mentioned my name. I know I'm not on any lists anywhere. I know you never betrayed me. As for you, you gotta figure that I never told anyone. That instead of gently decomposing in North Yankton, you're angrily decomposing in Los Santos with a shrink and a wife who don't love you no more. Yeah. Yeah, well, <laughs> since you put it like that... Hey, shut up a minute. I'm getting an eye-find alert. That little college boy sack of shit, phony fuck. Who? Jay Norris? Yes. That fuck is a lying bastard. I've read his fucking emails. He's a fucking cheat. Uh, I heard him say that he saved America. What, by, by outsourcing all the jobs? By selling us little bits of plastic restricted access shit? Well, now it's payback time, you lying turd. The hell are you talking about? You are about to get that white-collar gig that you always dreamed of, Mikey. Here, take this uh, fashionably retro weird for a 45-year-old man, but I cannot let go of the 1980s bag, and dress yourself up like a billionaire math genius with low-level Asperger's. You better be ready for the minor glitch of your repulsive pseudo-messianic life. Okay, Lester. Get out of here! Call me when you're ready. We are about to put the Darwinism back in social Darwinism. And brother, it is gonna be fun. You fucking kidding me? I'm a bank robber, not a web designer. So we'll go robbing soon. I'll find something. Just like the old days. Ah, excuse me. I got this interview at this tech company. I'm thinking I need something, I don't know, geeky, youthful. Lost your job and the world's moved on, huh? That's too bad. I didn't lose my job. Of course. Got too old, got outsourced. Same thing happened to my dad. Now you gotta fit in with a different generation. Hmm? What about a vest and some cargo shorts? Yup. 
Well, that's as youthful as you're gonna get. Dignity aside, I think that might just work. Good luck at the interview. Goodbye. Michael? I'm all dressed up. Now, you want to run me through this thing? The prototype is somewhere in the Life Invader office. Find it and fit it with the device in your bag. They just gonna let me in? Why wouldn't they if you look the part? Hang around till someone opens the door and act entitled. Fine. Hey. Hey. Oh, great. Ugh, PM's pushing for more functionality. <laughs> but we are maxed. I mean, if anything, we have to strip features, especially if we plan on releasing a fully yeah. priced update a year later. Oh, my. You know, it's. Yeah, well, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? I mean, we're talking beta in Q4, maybe Q3. Look, milestones are one thing, but when design is changing its mind yeah. seemingly overnight, there's not much you can do about it. You Look, know what I'm saying? Uh, my union allocated smoke bricks bowed up, so... Wait a minute. Do I know you? Yeah, I think so. I... I T-temp, right? Yeah. You know, you gotta do something for me. Ah, uh, you gotta put it in a ticket. Uh, no. I'd like to keep this one out of the database, if you know what I mean. I'm totally becoming a tech evangelist when the big boys vest. Maybe not even tech. I'll evangelize anything. Hi. Oh, hi. Chill out on the beanbag. Marcus will be right out. Oh, um, I'm gonna take a normal chair. I have a terrible back. Here you go. If you guys let me use the OS I requested, this wouldn't be a problem. Ah, oh, you've been added on this PC. Ah, uh, got any antivirus software? I think so. Behind this junk on the left. Clicked an NSFW link, bro. Bit me on the ass. Yeah, not safe for work, huh? You know, my son's computer runs into the same kind of problems. I'll close the pop-ups, see what I can do. Your son codes? Start him early, bro. You write your best stuff in your tweens. Scanning. You want to take a break for some air guitar? Give me the wink, bro. And that should do it. Why don't you try and keep things strictly safe for work from now on? Hey, have you seen the prototype in the demo room? When Norris announces it at the keynote, minds are gonna blow. Yes, they are. Send me the photo. <laughs> Dude, when it blue screens again, you're my guy. Bye.
Mine's on fire. Woo! What? Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Jim Hawks to stage. Hey, this company has come a long way since we started at Lifetime's Pool House in East Carroll. Today, you're about to witness a new phase. Full on weapons grade Riddler world domination. We have put a billion people's private data in a public domain and we have milked every penny we could in the process. And we have one of the youngest workforces in the world. And at the age of only 14.4 years, that's enough to say president, it's revolutionary. Today, right here, we're about to make the next step. Prepare to witness the future. <laughs> the Life Invader mobile device. Yes, we've invented something no one else has ever thought of. A small, personal, computerized device. Now you're going to be able to stay docked 24-7. On the bus, you can dock. On the subway, stay. Oh, hold on a second. I think someone's trying to dock with me. Hello? Oh! Ah, too hot! Jesus! Whoa! No, 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 Let's... No, 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 no. Whoa! That was heavy. You watching the news? I don't have to. I'm watching the markets. I'll be trading pure alpha till close. All right. Hey, about that other thing. You know the score. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Put on a suit, look somewhat professional, and meet me at my warehouse off the LS freeway. Oh, uh, and I'm about to email you a link for the exchange. You can put in some trades of your own. I'm trying to stay off the day trading. Uh, maybe I'll take a look. your linear entertainment. Go watch porn. Just go away. Shit. Fuck you! What the fuck? Disrespectful little asshole. I can't believe you did that. That's my TV. You don't talk to me like that. I can't believe you. Mom was right about you. You don't know any better and you can't help it, but you're an asshole. Yeah, well, why don't you do something then? Besides just stand there. Why don't you hit me? Is that what you want? To be hit by your son? Yeah. No. I just... Why you to do something besides sit there eating? Yeah, great. Thanks for the fucking guidance, Dad. It means a lot. Wait. I'm just trying to help you. Yeah. Well, nothing says I love you like smashing my fucking TV. Nothing at all. I'm sorry. I just wish we could do things together. Hey, what things? I don't know. Uh, go for walks. Play ball. You know I have bad glands. Bike ride, then. Bike ride? You want to go on a fucking bike ride? Fine, fine, let's go on a fucking bike ride. We'll take a bike ride along Vespucci Beach. And I'll show you just what you want to see. This day was going so well until you showed up, you know that? Oh, well, you're lucky to even be allowed out of the house. That boat stuck. What's the big deal? 
If anything goes wrong, you can just fake your death and start all over. How am I going to develop my own moral sensibilities when yours are so unbelievably fuck-based? Don't push me. Seriously, some guys borrow your bow. Borrow? You were hiding in the head crying kidnapped. They just took receipt of your property with payment pending. If it was anything other than what you told me, then that's on you. All right, they fucking stole it. And who knows what they would have done if they found me. You're driving like a psychopath, Michael. Do you realize that? Or are you so high on your own outmoded sense of masculinity that you think this is normal? Shut your pie hole. I think we'll both be happier if we can spend as little time in this vehicle as possible. God! You think I've got learning difficulties? You entitled piece of shit! You think I've got learning difficulties, huh? Take a good long look in the mirror, pal. I'm not the one who doesn't respect my fellow human beings. No, not unless they're a spick or a Jew boy or an ass munching homo. Oh, there was me thinking there's a difference between witty banter arising from a sense of competition. Witty? Really? And mowing someone down in the street? Hey, I never said you had learning difficulties, Jim. Here we are, the bike rental place. Please don't shoot the bike rental guy out of, like, force of habit. Hey, you. Two bikes. Take your pick. I'll take this one. like you're buying your own TV. You know, this is real nice, Dad. Bonding, good times. Yeah, yeah, I'm giving it my best shot. Come on, we're having fun, right? You wouldn't know fun if it sat on your face. Ah, come on. I mean, why do I have to hold your hand through this whole midlife crisis bullshit? And why don't you stick your nose up Tracy's butt sometime? Because Tracy doesn't buy cars she can't afford so that thugs break in our house. Tracy doesn't get kidnapped or destroy my yacht. Well, that's just because she's too busy getting fucked by dudes to get on TV. You don't talk about your sister that way. Well, I'm sorry, but it's true. I mean, according to her Life Invader page, she's hanging out with producers and porno guys this afternoon. What are you talking about? Actually, it's all happening right out there. What? That boat that makes yours look like a refugee raft? You know the kind of boat, the one that makes a young, impressionable girl drop her pants and spread her legs. This is the reason you brought me here, isn't it? You fuck. Ah! Dad, wait! Shit. Dad. Take me out of here. Dad, you're embarrassing me. These are my friends. Yeah, you're embarrassing her, dude. They're shooting porno here. They shoot porno all over town. Mom rented our house to them last summer. What? Our house? Yeah. Man, you got a killer pad, Mr. <laughs> Isn't it awesome? Let's go. <laughs> Those walls can talk. You think I do it? Hey. No. Hey. Shit, hey, Daddy. cool, man. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, oh, hey. Oh, oh, man. I like that. What's the problem? You're such a jerk. Come on. Dad, you dumbass. These guys are serious. Yeah, well, so am I. Talk to the scene of my fucking boat. Oh, motherfucker. Get on. Now, I'm about to skin you alive. God damn it. Go. No, 
you're not. You're an accessory to self-defense. Have I, like, got to be a witness because I, I, like, did some blow? You did blow? Yeah, I did some blow, and that might, like, make my testimony inadmissible. You're not admissing anything. There won't be a trial unless you're on a trial for doing blow. After you ruined my day, stole my friend's shit, capped them, and I'm the one on trial? They started it. And we wouldn't be in this mess if you hadn't hung out with some creepy-ass porno people and done blow. Oh, uh, you didn't know I did blow until I told you I did blow. So this should be like an increase in trust. In and porno dudes are like the best dudes I can be with. Porno dudes? Really? Yeah, they actually respect women and treat us right. It's Los Santos, Dad. What do you expect when he moved here? Asshole, okay? He smashed my TV and he took me to the beach. The beach with my skin. So what, you send him out to spoil my day too? I didn't know that he was gonna come get you. I just told him where you were. You know, he got that crazy look in his eyes, you know, like you get sometimes, and he just went. I'm getting a cap. I'm coming with you. How about I just drive us home? You ruined my life. I don't want to know. Franklin! What the fuck? I mean, what the hell going on here? Wait a minute. Franklin, what are you doing here? I live here. This half my house, too. So you say? Anyway, magenta is reinvigorating my femininity. So make yourself scarce, boy. Go. Go. With pleasure. Go. Goodness. And stay out of trouble! Yeah, yeah. Bitch, you ain't no more of a man than me. I hear that. Gangsta shit, nigga! Look who's bizarre. What's up, What's fool? With it, man? Oh, no, no. Show some respect here, nigga. That man, they couldn't hold down his back. Come on now. Damn, man. I gotta spend my day with another middle-aged fool trying to recapture his youth. what this fool just say? I missed you, dawg. Oh, oh. You missed me, huh? Nah, I ain't missed you. Your ass could've stayed gone for good. So I fucked your girl, mm -hmm. mugged your mom, mm. and better yet, I ain't thought about your ass in years. Ha, ha. You got jokes now, huh? Hey, but I see you doing well for yourself. Check that on out. Shit, I'm doing just fine. That's what I hear. But I know some sweet boys up in the pen that got bigger balls than you. Oh, you been doing your time looking at sweet boy balls? Uh -huh. Yeah, it's good to have confirmation. This funny fuck. Why you keep hanging around this clown, L? Shake this fool, we man. We from the same set, Stretch. Why, why y'all niggas can't get along? Y'all been doing this shit for years, man. You know what, dawg? It's good you back home. Glad you here. Missed you, boy. Damn, you definitely got hit up inside. Hit up? Hey, hey. Yo, motherfucker, I know little niggas like you been turned out on the daily. Talking about being hit up, nigga, I swear, man. You ain't got no motherfucking respect. Motherfucker, I got respect for reality. Reality? All right. All right, you keep thinking that. Just keep thinking that, nigga. Shit, you gonna get yours. Fuck you. Uh, I swear, man. Whoa, Come on, whoa, whoa, man. Cool out. Fuck, Chill, man? man. This motherfucker get on my goddamn nerves. The nigga get on my nerves, too, man. Part of the nigga charm, man. F, come on, man. Let's just bust a move, man. You gonna drive or what, Phil? Drive where? Pick up this heat, nigga. Why? Business, nigga. Real business. Come on, girl. Y'all niggas act like girls. Shit. Not me. Shit. Ammunition. Come on, let's go. Shit, homie, you gonna drop all that bread on that gear, you might as well get a haircut, too. Fucking crazy-haired microphone, motherfucker. I got a microphone I can shove right in your prison pocket. Nigga, you walk like you keister and shit anyway. You know, when I went away, you punks was little homies, and I was a big homie. Now I'm out, and you little homies is big homies. But you still gotta respect. Man, what the fuck this nigga talking about? We all big homies, but he bigger, right? As soon as we get this shit, as soon as we get paid, homie. As soon as we get incarcerated, more likely. Ammunition, armorer to the stars. Hey, what's up, man? Fire.
All right, homie, get your shotgun with the flashlight modification. Hey, you got cash? Oh, you flat, homie? I would think you was fiending, but ain't no fiends that fat. Take this cheese, you old broke-ass bitch. <clears throat> now, just let me reinstate, man, that the purchases made by this man ain't got nothing to do with the two gentlemen of fella nature. That's right. Yeah. Now, let's go bust on some niggas. Man, we got some recycling to do. Come on, man. Send her off friends in La Puerta. Some cans or some shit I don't know about? Nah, homie. We got ourselves a drug deal. Why do I get the feeling it's gonna be one of them deals gone wrong type situations? Now, see, that's that negative attitude Lamar was telling me about, nigga. You ain't getting nowhere thinking like that. The power of positive bullshit. You ought to be clenching your motherfucking vagina muscles with my hunt, nigga. After his bid, it probably need tightening up. This ain't new age shit. It's fact. You get what you get, fool. You been getting dick, but you ain't giving it, huh? Some Mark talk like that to an OG? <laughs> CGF has changed, man. No wonder the hood is so lame right now. Speaking of change, Lamar's been meaning to talk to you, homie. Nah, nah, not now, homie. What's happening? It's nothing, my nigga, nothing, you know? Just some ideas, that's all. Man, ideas ain't your strong suit, so put it on me. It's nothing real, homie. When it's something real, we'll talk. Hey, we meeting them here. Man, how'd you find this place? The homie set it up. It's the kind of spot where we ain't gonna be disturbed. That's what the fuck worries me. I'm more of a hide-in-the-plain-sight type of nigga. Ha, ha, ha! What's up, fool? What up, We it? got that shit, nigga, with a paper hat. Nigga, I'm talking about Buku Bill. More Davis. <laughs> What's up, boy? Everything cool? Yeah. Hold on, man. What the fuck, man? You was just kidnapping this nigga. Oh, oh come, come on, on dog. Now, don't real yeah. recognize real. D, my nigga, just got out crossing lines, did some time with some of your folks. Hey, look, look, look. This ain't about you, man. What? You know these niggas done. Yo, what fuck the fuck up? this trick talking about, man? Yeah, What's yeah, that? yeah, yeah, yeah. Somebody see, see, on us? They put a nigga on TV, man, about some gang intervention shit. Hey, this ain't the police, dog. This some ballers bullshit. Nigga, that's some man. bullshit. Fuck you. What's up with hey, we've been set up, nigga. This shit fuck fuck up. Fuck you, nigga. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Oh, bitch ass ballers. Come on, through here. Here's the fire door! D! 
these motherfuckers on the sky, dog. We ain't going nowhere with that top bomb. Take it out. something with the ballers shit i don't care if you cgf for life man you done done you dig actually we ain't cgf for life because all that means is we giving you money for nothing we got our own shit now homie foreign gangsters oh no no he don't mean that low f just talking outside his neck i'm gonna reach cross lines all right conversate with the purple homies yeah yeah that's a good idea man smart shit but if i gotta hang you assholes out fast the gang comes first Oh, it ain't gonna come to that, homie. You all diplomatic and shit. Yeah, he a real fucking diplomat, ain't he? This that peace-talking motherfucker we should have sent to the Middle East. Fuck. No wonder I want to get out of here. No one's stopping you, little homie. Here we are, man. You gonna hang with your auntie while the men break it off. Shut the fuck up. Hell no, nah, nigga. You sounding more and more like a snee eye yitch every day. Hell no, nah, yeah. nigga. I sound like somebody trying to make some paper and not get killed. He's a hook ass nigga, I told nigga, you. Nigga, go toss a salad, stretch mark ass bitch. Bust it. What the hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. And they say it cannot be hit. It hasn't been yet. Look, I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Oh, well, gems it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but nah, he went quiet. All right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. The shop's on Little Portola. Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back in business? 
FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP. The WPP thing doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. Well, for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Well, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Okay, let's get this done. Oops, <laughs> excuse me. You reading me? Mm-hmm. Okay, we need shots of the security features, the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. Thank you. The alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. Glasses are live, shoot away. Alarms, vents, cameras, remember? All right, I got an idea of their CCTV setup. Uh, can you shoot an air vent in the alarm keypad? Come on, we need a shot of the alarm console. The keypad and we're done. A shot of the alarms come through. Good work. Now speak to the assistant and see if there's anything else we need to know. Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. The same my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe... 10 grand? Our rings start at 8, our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Drive us around the block. We gotta find a way up to the roof. If you can get up to the roof, we need a shot of the setup up there. So, you keep up with the old crew? Well, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. I saw a ladder. Climb up it and see if you can get to the roof. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? I kept tabs on him for a while. Needed to, uh, know that he didn't blame me. I'm on the roof. I need to know where the air coming out of those vents in Vangelico originates. There should be a unit above the store. <sighs> yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. Hey, I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? I've pulled up a satellite image. It looks like the highest point is on the northwest side. Get a shot from there. Right, you're well placed to take the photo of the system now. That's the shot. It's on the roof now. Okay, 
That'll do. Now come back to me before someone spots you up there. Oh. Will do. Let's speed this up. We don't want to draw attention. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told them to start setting up the information. So, what did you see? Nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. You might be able to wipe the remote. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die the rich assholes to rub his nose in it. Uh, good. The alarm system's linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window if someone talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register. So I'd start there. Mm, glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof. Means you could smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open, then? Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. I might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. Here are the photos. My uh, workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Uh, well, I'm gonna figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Don't wanna leave evidence behind in a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right, not for a pro. <laughs> well. Mapping out the options, you know, showing you all the angles. That's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions, that is your domain, my friend. Here. Now, there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. It means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by L.S. SPD tactical team, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the L.S. River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? Ah, you've grown wise and cautious in your old age. Okay, select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out. Eddie Cho, now you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't make much difference. Gus Moda. He's a pro. Not much else to say. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. This guy, Ricky. I met him at the Life Invader office. He may not be that good, but he's enthusiastic. Harris. <laughs> good. Feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got.
Great. Uh, I'll do some research on the pest control van and the knockout gas, and I'll be in touch. Uh, yes. Huh? Good. Good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa. What? My rep don't count for nothing no more. You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you. Hey, what's up? Hey, man, it's me, Michael. What's going on? Listen, um, I gotta get hold of the money for that house we pulled down, so uh, I'm getting a crew together for, uh, you can guess. The pay will be awful, and the risk will be high, but you might learn something if you're interested. Man, that's not exactly a great sales pitch, dog. but I guess I gotta start somewhere. Thank you. Maybe one day you can put together your own deals, your own jobs. So. There's still some preparation I gotta do. Sit tight for a while. My buddy Lester will get in touch with the details. Lord, it's time.